So guys, I am back with yet another Black Myth Wukong video. Uh, earlier today, guys, I uploaded a video showcasing an infinite mana glitch, which requires some perfect timing to get to work. Well, let me tell you, it just got a whole heap crazier because now, guys, you don't need timing whatsoever. This is so wild, you probably won't believe your eyes. But hey, this will allow you to have infinite duplicates, infinite spells, infinite cloud step, you name it. It's that world. How's it going guys? My name is DPJ. Now I'm giving away a copy of this game. So if you want to win Black Myth Wukong for yourself or even a friend who doesn't own it, it's as simple as this. Drop a like on this video, leave a comment down below and make sure you are subbed. I will pick one winner from the comment section of one of my Black Myth Wukong videos and announce them at the end of the week. So good luck everybody. Okay, so if you caught my glitch video from earlier on today, you would have seen that this glitch is utterly broken. It's the same glitch, it's just way, 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 way easier to do. There's no uh, time required to do this whatsoever. All you gotta do is just spam out buttons. I mean, it's so easy. A child could do this. A five-year-old could do this. Yeah, and also guys, you wanna use this while you can, if this is your kind of thing, because as soon as they click onto this, it is getting patched out of the game. So I just wanna showcase you guys right now, I have no, well, I have insufficient mana. I haven't got no glitch whatsoever, I can't do anything, as you can see. Now I'm just going to rest to showcase to you guys how easy this glitch is now to achieve. It's beyond easy to achieve now. So I'm just going to rest. And there's a few things you do need to know about this as well, requirements too. So requirements first, you need to have a cloud step. So make sure you have cloud step and you have this equipped. Normally up on your d-pad if you're playing on the controller. You also guys need to have the pillar stance. So as you can hear, staff stances, pillar stance, and you also want to have this right here, sweeping gale. Make sure you have this. So yes. Now guys, all you need is one focus point. So I'm just gonna get a focus point. Just sort of like this people. Oh, wait, it's happy quick. You gonna give me one? No, you ain't because you're too soft. This guy will. Okay, so now I have a focus point. Now guys, it really is this simple and I won't believe what you're gonna see. So all you gotta do is you gotta trigger your sweeping gale, which will take that focus point we just made. And to do this, you need to trigger that via a light combo. So you start off with a light combo, you'll press your heavy attack, and then you'll do your going to your sweeping gale. Once you're in your sweeping gale, all you gotta do is just spam out cloud step. Just spam it out, hold down that trigger, and just spam out that Y button if you're on Xbox controller on PC, if you're playing on PlayStation 5, spam out triangle. So it's as simple as this. Light attack, sweeping gale, and spam it out. Just keep pressing it, guys. Don't stop pressing it until you do a shade uh, uh, cloud step. So when you land into a cloud step, while you constantly spamming it, you've now entered the glitch. Now, if you look at your cloud step bar, you'll see now that as soon as it fills back up, you can use it again. And now we are in the glitch. Literally, guys, we are in this glitch. So if we go up to, let's say, this guy here. There we go. We are in the glitch, guys. He ain't going anywhere. I could pull out infinite amounts of uh, duplicates. Constantly pulling them out if I want to. Freeze him on the spot. Everything, even when you run out of mana, people, don't worry. you still got it all. It is absolutely what Oh, he's dead. <laughs> yep. Even when you run out of mana, it's absolutely wild. There's a bigger guy over here. Let's go and take him on. And I'll show you just how what it's so broke. Actually, did he die? Did I? I think I might have already killed him. Yeah, I did. I already killed him. I took him out ages ago. But yeah, the glitch is absolutely broken. Now, what I'll also say is to get out of the glitch, guys, resting doesn't do it. If you rest, it does not take you out of this glitch. Believe it or not, you stay in it, and I'll show it to you right now. I'm just gonna go back to that that shrine. How wild is that? There's no time required whatsoever. All you gotta do is spam out a button, and it puts you into a game-breaking glitch, which you could just use and abuse on any boss you want to. Which just, in my opinion, it takes the fun out of the game. I ain't gonna use this on any bosses. Well, there's one boss that's doing my head in, but yeah, I ain't going to use it to progress. Nothing like that. But hey, if this is your thing, do what you got to do. I'm showcasing it to you. I ain't, I, ain't, I ain't putting an opinion on nobody, but as you can see, guys, we still have the glitch. 
even when that mana runs out, guys. Doesn't matter. Insufficient mana, we still have the glitch. Yeah. So how do you get out of it? Well, when you transform, this takes you out of the glitch. So as soon as you come back into your normal uh, monkey self, you're now out of the glitch. And you'll see this right here, guys. Boom! So as you can see now, I'm out of the glitch. But to get back into the glitch, people, even when you have no mana, you can do it the exact same way. Just get yourself a focus point. This guy again. Boop, boop, boop. Boom. Okay, one more. Come here, fella. Okay, so we have ourselves a focus point. Now you'll see, even though we have no mana, you can still activate that cloud step. So light attack, light attack, heavy attack, and spam it. Spam it out. Just keep spamming it. And there you go. As soon as you do that cloud step when you hit the floor, you are in the glitch. It's really is that simple. What you'll also notice as well, guys, is when you're in this, you have some wild rolling, like... I don't even know what this is. This could be something to do with cloud step, but even when your stamina runs out, you move like Blanca out of Street Fighter. <laughs> How wild? You ain't catching nobody, boy! Ba boom but yeah, how mad is that, guys? So yeah, use and abuse this while you can, like I said. To come out of it, if you fast travel to another area. I'm not sure if you're on the same, if you're in the same chapter. We'll try that out. But if you definitely tra fast travel to a, let's go here. Or another area, sorry. Where actually are we? We are. So let's just go to, say here, this is the shrine down the road. If you fast travel to another shrine... Does it take you out of it? I know if you fast travel the whole different area, it takes you out of the glitch. But I'm not sure about another shrine within the same area. But we will see. We will see. But again, resting for me doesn't take me out of it, which is wild, guys. So let's have a look. No, you're not an enemy. Let's go down here. There's got to be an enemy somewhere down here. Oh, no. See, I'm still in it. I'm still in the glitch. You can tell by that wild roll I got. I can see actually I could just pull out my monkeys. Yep, yeah, still in the glitch. So when you fast travel to the same region, the same area, that like can you see this for an instance now, for an example. So we are in the New West, we're in the Valley of Ecstasy. If I fast travel to any of these, I stay in the glitch. But, so let's say I go to Yellow, let's just go to the village entrance. This will take me out. So when you fast travel to a different area, or a different chapter, it takes you out of it. But here we are, you'll see that I'm now out of the glitch. So I'll try and pull out my monkeys. Insufficient mana to do so. There we go. So there we have it, guys. Guys, if you enjoyed the video, leaving a like it really helps out. If you feel like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. And hopefully, guys, I will see you on that next one.